comment down below because I will be doing some of everything until I find exactly what I majority what. <laughs> it's me key and i am here with my very first video for you guys i wanted to start my youtube channel for so long and i'm glad that i finally get to do that and thank you guys for watching this video um what better way than to get this started than with a get to know me tag so i'm gonna be answering a few questions um about myself and that way you guys can get to know me a little bit better so if you want to see more Stay tuned. So I just wrote some questions down and then I'm just going to answer them that way. So first question is, what's my full name? My name is Kiana. Everyone calls me Key. And if you want to know more about my full, full name, then comment down below. But for right now, my name is Kiana, period. What's my favorite color? My favorite color is purple and it has been purple since probably since I was born. I don't know. I've had this weird obsession with like everything purple and I just changed my computer color. So it's not purple anymore, but literally everything else, purple, 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 all shades of purple, maybe not like Barney color purple, but more like lavender shades and all that stuff. Yeah. Um, last song I listened to was Pony by the baby. Shout out because he's from Charlotte and I live in Charlotte now. How tall are you? I'm about five, 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 six. Did you go to college? Yes, I went to the University of South Carolina. Go Gamecocks. And fun fact, my mom and my dad went there as well. So this is kind of like a continuing thing and I don't know, but my mom didn't pressure me to go to USC, but my dad definitely was like, you're not going anywhere else, and I uh, will have you applied to USC yet. Do they send you an offer late yet? Are you going there? I'm not paying for you to go anywhere else, so whatever. <laughs> Did you play sports? No, but I was a cheerleader since probably like the age of, I don't know like four or five but I didn't do it in college I stopped that high school because by that time I was over it for other reasons so favorite vloggers I love YouTube and I spend majority of my day on YouTube just watching videos and everything so I can go on and on about my favorite vloggers but just to name a few I would say Kaylin and Kyra, the Edwards family, the Dunstans, um, Jackie Ina, of course, Deer and Ken. Congrats to them on their recent engagement. Um, Chef B, who else? I like Charlena, Jasmine Gonzalez. Guys, I could go on and on. Oh, oh, Annabelle Hayes. Annabelle Hayes, gotta put her in there. But yeah, all in all, love YouTube love vloggers so i live if you guys have any recommendations put them down below because i will check them out um moving along single or taken i am happily taken by my boyfriend of two plus years and you guys will probably see him on this channel so um he's a character right we'll just leave it at that <laughs> favorite childhood memory um what is my favorite childhood memory? I would say probably like going to Disney World or something. I don't know. I've been to Disney World so many times and with like my family, other people's families, extended families. It was one time where we were going like year after year. So probably some of my best memories have been at Disney World. And I know when I was a really young kid, like I would run around with like one of the little um, autograph books for the little characters to sign in my book i know had to go to like the little disney tea parties Minnie mouse ears like i was that little kid so <laughs> definitely disney world um favorite food favorite food honestly guys my favorite food used to be steak 
and then I stopped eating beef and pork as much as I used to and now when I try to eat a steak I just I just can't eat it the same so I don't even know if it deserves to be my favorite food anymore but I will say oddly enough that I live for a good salad and <laughs> every time that I tell somebody that they always look at me like salad like that's not food and I'm like how do you not like salad it's so good just give me a salad mixed veggies all that a good salad dressing and i will eat that all day long every day three meals breakfast lunch and dinner that's it um let's see what is at the top of your bucket list if you know me then you know that i really like to travel and I want to travel the world. Biggest thing on my bucket list is I want to travel the world. And I want to do that with people who enjoy traveling as much as I do. So travel the world, travel all around the world. I want to see so many places and have so many experiences before I die that I can be able to tell other people about and just encourage other people to travel. So. If you guys know a way that I can do that for free <laughs> or for cheap, let me know. I do, you know, find deals and everything and traveling groups a lot. So um, that's kind of how we stay on budget and not try to go crazy on a vacation. But yeah, travel the world, definitely. Another notable mention, though, is probably skydiving. Yeah. Um... Do I have any tattoos? I do not have any tattoos and I have been saying I was going to get a tattoo since I was like 16. I don't know. And <laughs> every year I'm like, I'm getting a tattoo this year. I want a tattoo. But then it's like, I don't know what I want. And uh, I don't know where I want it and all these things. And then once I finally figured out what type of tattoo I did want, people are like, oh my gosh, that's like the place that it's going to hurt the most. And I'm just like, well. Okay, I'm not getting a tattoo anymore. But my aunt recently found out that I did not have any tattoos. So now for my birthday in two months, I have to suck it up and go get a tattoo with her. So guys, stay on the lookout for a vlog of me getting the first tattoo. I can tell you right now. <laughs> I can tell you right now, it's not going to be anything over the top nothing extravagant probably gonna be simple one word something i don't know but you got you guys will definitely get to come along and see that because that is gonna be a treat <sighs> when is the last time you cried i i don't know i don't know we're gonna have to I don't know. Let's throw that question out because I don't know the last time I cried. Scary movies or happy endings? Definitely happy endings because I am not a scary movie type of person. I hate scary movies and every time it's time for all the scary movies to come out in the movie theater, you won't catch me. I'm not even looking at the trailers, okay? Because me and scary movies do not get along like at all like i remember i went to see a scary movie when i was like 14 and the whole way home i was just sitting there like i just know somebody's about to jump out in front of this car it just kill us i don't know i don't know what it is i know they're fake and all this stuff but what gets me really is the scary movies that are based on a true story or true facts or whatever they call them like uh what is it like amityville horrors no um what's the other movie was the conjuring based in real thing i don't know was it the conjuring or something else one of those movies me and my cousin sat and watched that movie no we didn't watch the movie the movie watched us because we were looking at the movie through the mirror <laughs> that just don't give me a scary movie romance action all day but no scary movies um favorite drink my absolute favorite drink is water. I live for a very good ice cold bottle of water. Please give me water all day long. My weakness would be an orange soda, but I don't drink soda anymore. So water all day, every day. What is one of your bad habits? 
I would say, honestly, procrastination is up there, but I would say more than anything would probably be that I get in my head a lot about a lot of things. So anytime that I want to do something, like say I wanted to start this YouTube channel, but every time I got in my head of like some reason that I couldn't do it or some reason that it wouldn't work out or whatever it was and that just like prolonged it. So that would led into my procrastination of why I couldn't start it and why I couldn't do this video. So I would say that that's something that I constantly struggle with, but I always have to have like reminders of myself that I can do whatever I want to do. Um, so I would say that I get in my head a lot about everything so much so that it's like detrimental, but we're working on that. Um, next question. How old am I? I am 23, about to be 24 in what, two months I said? November 27th. Woo -woo. Um, where's my sign? So November 27th, two months to my birthday. I'm a Sagittarius and I am such a Sagittarius. Like textbook, everything about a Sagittarius. Look me up in the dictionary because I'm by that word. Just, it's just that simple. <laughs> um what is my eye color my eye color is brown a very dark brown so is my hair but sometimes you can't tell and i don't know it used to be lighter but both my eyes and my hair used to be lighter but now they're darker my favorite subject in school again oddly enough my favorite subject in school was math like i live for a math problem math geek to the fullest and <laughs> least favorite Sadly to say, this is not gonna sound very good, but history, like, I don't know, I just couldn't focus. Like, give me a math problem all day long and I could focus on that. Like, I wanna figure it out and it was just history. Was favorite type of music? Hip hop, R&B, hip hop and R&B. Favorite animal? White tiger. I went to like this animal safari when I was younger and it had a white tiger there and it was so beautiful and i just fell in love with it from that day so every day since then my favorite animal has been a white tiger and it was so sad because it was just sitting in the cage and it looked so sad like obviously it didn't want to be there so that kind of made me feel for it as well favorite celebrity right now this girl is killing the game savage fenty rihanna love her if you guys did not see her fashion show please go on amazon prime video and look at that because that was just a concept a vibe and i live for it i wish i could be there modeling for her riri if you're listening i would love to model for you <laughs> just putting that out there um biggest turn off i have a lot of those a lot of pet peeves too but i will say that one of my biggest is a liar cannot stand a liar at all they really grind my gears and i just can't deal with that um but another one oh dirty people like people who don't keep their houses and stuff in order like I'm a very clean person you see like I'm very organized everything is in its place and I can find it but I know that some people function in like stuff that isn't organized but that's just me personally I can't, I can't deal with it um where do I live oh I don't know. did I say I don't know I live in Charlotte North Carolina now I'm originally from South Carolina but I live in Charlotte North Carolina now um what do I do in my spare time <laughs> Pinterest, Pinterest all day. Um, looking for different DIYs to do, different, different everything to do DIY. I look for a good DIY or anything that deals with like organization to make my life easier or something that I can use that's practical, like art or something like that. I'll do that all day long. DIY, whatever. I'll try it out send me any DIYs you guys want to see because I will do them as well and last question do you watch sports yes I do um I watch I love football so um growing up me and my mom and the rest of my family as well we watch football together so I really 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 like watching football shout out to the Steelers because that's my favorite team um 
we my family everybody in my family played this sport and most of them played basketball so we watch basketball majority majority of the time too that's what everybody wants to watch football basketball and then uh, a lot of the women in my family like to watch tennis not so much the men i don't know it's just a preference but we love serena of course um, and we live for watching a good tennis match. So that's all my questions, you guys. I am, again, I'm so excited that I finally got to start this YouTube channel and I can't wait to upload some more videos. Uh, stay tuned, cause you will see, like I said, moments from my life coming around with me, try on hauls, um, tutorials, DIY projects, anything that you guys wanna see, comment down below. Cause I will be doing some of everything until I find exactly what I majority what <laughs> comment down below with what you guys want to see because i will be doing a few different things on this channel until i see something that i really want to stick with or i might just continue doing random stuff who knows but if you want to see something comment down below make sure you like comment and subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss my videos bye